welcome back to the channel. My name is Ronaldo Mo with PPG. And if you are a new viewer, welcome aboard. My existing viewers, welcome back. Got a quick one for you. Let's talk water pressure, incoming water pressure. It's critical that you know that number. You never want that number to be too high. You definitely don't want it to be too low. So I'm about to give you a very quick and accurate way to get that number. You need to know what that PSI number is, that water pressure coming into your house. So stay tuned. You want to take your pressure gauge, find your laundry room, wash machine box, take your pressure gauge, cold water side, screw the gauge on tight to that valve, cold water side. Once you get it screwed down really tight, just open that, that valve up and get your reading. You never want that number to be over 80 PSI. It's too high. You don't want low water pressure either say around 30 or 40, you want to be around between 55 and 65, ideally a sweet spot around 60. And if it's too high or too low, you want to locate your PRV. You want to find out where your PRV is and check it out, see what kind of condition it's in. It could be leaking. I'm not sure. Um, you can always adjust it here at the top. This is your adjusting screw, but always check out your PRV if the pressure is too high or too low. So in, in closing, you always wanna use your wash machine box to get an accurate reading of the pressure coming into your house. Typically, the wash machine box is downstream of the PRV, this is where you're going to get your most accurate reading.